Welcome back, folks. I'm going to play a little Tour 8 for you. i got to get this finished up here eventually. Someday it'll happen. Um, probably should set myself to doing it, but... Anyways... We'll see what happens here. Well, this is a fun hole. There's not much extra you can do to it uh, other than just tap it down the end here. You don't have to go crazy. There's no secret. Great shot. Um, just make sure you line yourself up for a good second shot at the green. And that's basically what you want to do. You don't want to go killing it because it's going to go all the way down the end and into the rough now down and into the rough down the end there i don't think it's the end of the world if you do happen to do it but um you're going to have a better second shot on the fairway than you are on the rough obviously so there's no point in killing it just tap it down there and away you go Now let's see what we can get out of this here. I might go back here. Now this one you want to keep to the right side of the flag because of the hill that rolls down. And this is going to come in hot. see what we can pull off here. I'm going to put a bit of right on uh, Hit it great, so that didn't help any. We'll see if this somewhat sticks up here. Okay, a little bit too far, but easy little chip. As you can see how it rolls down on the um, left side of the flag. Looking at it from this side, <clears throat> It'll roll down quite a ways down the hill there, so just try and keep it up top a little bit. Now he went through the club switch there and didn't readjust, which is very strange to me, but... Great shot! And you see what happened, because he didn't readjust, he just clobbered it. I mean, good for me, but... Horrible for him. So as you can see with the rapier the circle there my circle is so small it's the same size as the hole so i really don't need to adjust this at all or allow for the wind or anything like that i could Perfect completely shot. botch this shot and it's still gonna go in so just keep that in mind when you're uh, chipping real close put a lot of top spin on it let the ball do the work and uh, then you don't have to worry about the wind so this should be fairly easy for him if he can get it perfect if he doesn't get it perfect it's not going to go in Not great. He's gonna end up missing just by a bit because of the uh, nice 
not getting the perfect. But there you have it. Little Tour 8 win for you. So if you guys are not part of the group, um, Facebook group, Golf Clashers, or our new group, uh, Golf Clash Learner Burn, and uh, you're going to want to sign up for this group. There is a very exciting thing happening that uh, we've got a website coming out that will be very informative um, when it comes to anything to do with Golf Clash. So I can't give you that information, but if you sign up to the Learner Burn group, it will all be placed on there so that you can uh, sign up for this website to get you know, emails and whatever else that comes with it. Don't want to ruin the surprise. It uh, should be fun. But uh, check it out. You can also go to wiggleboomsports.com, get some t-shirts, stuff like that. Um, you can also follow me on Twitter, 97warren97. You'll get a lot of that info on there as well. But uh, anyway, for now, thanks for watching, guys, and we'll catch you on the next video.